everyone. Hello. So today we're taking you to Pigeon Forge. We're gonna walk around, check out the sights, maybe get some lunch, mm -hmm. maybe a cocktail. So thanks for joining us today. Let's go check it out. Let's go. Good, but like that's say all day. <laughs> It's so beautiful over here. <laughs> we had no idea this was even here. It's the Apple Barn and Cider Mill. We're here at the Apple Barn and Cider Mill and General Store. Here in Sevierville, Tennessee. It's a whole little area there's a winery there's a couple of restaurants they have an ice cream shop hard cider everything apple i'm assuming <laughs> so we're gonna go check it out i'm assuming these are apple trees i don't see any apples on them though so i don't know there's restrooms right there the here. smell in here is amazing <laughs> I was like cinnamon. Apple, cinnamon, like the best warm hug you've ever had. Apple fritter mix, apple pancake mix, apple syrup, <gasps> apple barbecue sauce. Are you serious? How many carbs? Six. Everything in here is apples. <laughs> apple soap dispenser, apple plates, apple bowls. I want this. I'm not even quite sure what it is, but I, I want it. What is this? I don't know. Is it like each of these are on sale, or is this one thing? I want it. I don't know what I'll put in no, it. No, you want what's in your hand. Oh, for, yeah, we're, we're getting this. Dutch apple strudel coffee. Mm. We love coffee, if you haven't noticed yet. <laughs> yes, it is. Dolly. You want a pop? Apple Country Kitchen. Oh, it's the ultimate brownies. Apple banana nut bread. Hi, Grandma Jerry. I got something to show you. She loves her apple cider. And they have it a looks whole delicious. They have, they have peach as well. Cherry. Cherry. Wow, it looks delicious. Mm -hmm. We're not even going to tempt ourselves by going in this section. <laughs> oh my god, there's so <laughs> much. Do there's so yet. much. Don't do it. Just look away. Look away. Okay. I looked, I looked away. <laughs> oh, more apple cider. More apple cider. <laughs> now we're going upstairs. This place is huge. There's even another upstairs. Cow pillow. And rooster lamps. Anybody need a rooster lamp? I was gonna call them something else, but I decided to keep the peach. <gasps> you found them again? I think it's a sign. Do you need a tractor? Yeah. <laughs> I wanna ride one at least. Oh shoot, there's another round, you ready? Let's do it. All right. To the right, to the right. We're at the tippy top of the barn. Not much up here. Well, hopefully if you can see it, we'll show you in the video. There's some apple orchard right out there. It's beautiful. And we bought the coffee. And we did, we told you we were gonna do it. And we did it. It was 9.86. We'll let you know how it is once we brew it tonight. Mm. The smokehouse. Ooh, apple pie kitchen. Oh my god. Looks so good. Did you, you didn't even see that. I was looking at apple butter. Oh. <laughs> 
Oh my god, where are you going? Oh my god. Hard cider house. Are you kidding me? Seriously? Ooh, it actually looks fun in here. Are you excited? Alright. Free tastings! What? I love it. New seasonal flavor, honey basil. Apple heart cider, ginger apple heart cider, blueberry apple heart cider, pop apple. What? Muscadine? I don't know what that word is. Apple blueberry rhubarb, boysenberry apple. Mmm, you sound delicious. Menu. Try them all for five dollars. Oh, I think we're gonna do that. So these are apple, cranberry, and blackberry that they let you try. You want to be on TV? Do you want to be on TV? You could be famous. <laughs> K and E R V T V on YouTube. Check us out. <laughs> Alright, the first one we're gonna try is Hop Zen. It tastes, it tastes like grapefruit. You didn't know I do a very classic. She did last bite. Don't want to fit. Top secret. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Alright, this one tastes like spiked ginger, ginger ale. Spiked ginger ale. You know the blueberry? Blackberry? Ooh. It does. Wow, that's so funny. Ooh. It tastes like ginger ale. Alright, green apple. This is the south. It's the base for all their ciders. Well, I could drink that all day. Yeah, that's good. You get sweetness from the honey, but you'll be able to taste hints of that basil. This is the seasonal one I said earlier, honey basil. You said you'll taste hints of the basil. Oh, for sure. That tastes like basil. Oh my God. Not my favorite. I like that a lot. <laughs> Sweet with the candy apple flavor. <laughs> oh yeah, I was more scared of that than I should have been. All right, yeah. apple and boysenberry, yeah, like sangria. Here's the sad part. We're now the new bar. She said it tastes like a sweet tart. Yeah. But about three things means we'll probably be back. Yeah, not too Oh, we're putting these things back. Like we just took all these shots in like two minutes. Blue cider house blues. Blueberry and apple. Cider house blues. Apple and blueberry. The skins of the blueberry. The whole crowd is just cheering. Good. Shocker. <laughs> Alrighty, we got a flight of some of the ciders that we just tasted. Sitting at these cute tables next to the apple trees. So our first one is Cider House Blues, Blues which I feel like should be blue, but <laughs> it is not. The blueberry and the mm. hard apple cider. Save me some, girl. You drank the whole thing. Well, I tasted it before we sat down. Oh. Sorry. It makes Shocker. me. It makes me think of rosé. Like it's good, but like rosé that's, all day. <laughs> that's what it reminds me of. Do you concur? I like blueberries, so I like it. Do you think it tastes like rosé? Does it remind you of that? I don't drink much rosé. <laughs> True, she's not a really a wine person. But you've had it in your life. No. Okay. On to the berry patch. Sweet tart combo of hard apple cider and boysenberries tastes like blackberry and raspberry. It does. It that does. one that one is good. It was hard because we, we tasted them so quickly in the mm -hmm. tasting, so you know, you, you get it for a moment and then you're like the That's next day. Cool. I like this one. I mean the next second you don't remember it's what it tastes good. like. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Like they literally you did a shot after shot after mm -hmm. shot. I mean we could have like, damn like Give me a second, lady. We could have taken our time, but there was a lot of people waiting, so mm -hmm. we didn't want to be. They were trying to get you in. And out. Yeah, so give you a buzz. <laughs> so blue barb is our next one. Blue barb is blueberry rhubarb and hard apple cider. What yeah, this one's a little more tart. <laughs> I don't know tart. what rhubarb tastes like. <laughs> it's a little more rhubarb. It's a little more tart than sweet. 
Yeah. It's not bad though. Mm -mm. That's why we picked it. <laughs> the only one I didn't like was the honey basil. Yeah, and I love basil. I actually really like that one. It was one. weird. Man, it, 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 it was weird, but. Or the next one is ginger ale. Sip gingerly. Sip gingerly. Yeah, it definitely tastes like ginger ale. Minds you of having like a stomach ache or something, <laughs> but in a good way. I'll finish it off, don't worry. Who's having fun out there? We're having a great time. I think we're gonna head to the wine tasting next. There's a couple of wineries here as well, so. This was a happy accident today. I don't like wine. Where's the beer, please? <laughs> PSA, when you don't eat carbs, you get a buzz quick. <laughs> it's about time. I've been waiting for Buzz Kim to show up for a few months now. <laughs> oh, still back. oh, we found the troublemakers again. <laughs> so, so what are you, you guys doing? You can't see him. You can't see no, him. Can't see him. No, he's so invisible. So you got clearance. You got clearance. What are you guys Somehow, doing here today? We actually, honestly, we were just driving around Painted Forge. We were visiting the area and we just turned off the street by accident. Cool, cool. And saw <laughs> all of this. Awesome. Yeah, we were like, um, that's where we're going today. So here but we you're go. here. What are you here for? What, what's, um, we what actually, are you pitching for? We have a YouTube channel. We live in our RV full time, and we're just traveling around the U.S. right now. Oh, that's cool. Hey, so that's cool. what we're doing. Oh, sweet. Well, I can recommend several distilleries. Yes, tell me about those. Oh, yeah. All right, this is the candy and apple chocolate factory. You want to tempt yourself? So, oh, look. I want to smell it. Let's just look at the window. I want to smell it. I do. I want to smell it. Smell better in the Apple Store. It smells better in the Apple Store. It's taffy. All but kinds of taffy. Peanut butter, peanut butter, chocolate, vanilla. Mm. Ooh, camo beans. <laughs> You're done. Mm. Ooh, the ice cream factory. No, I want to go. Oh, I feel like I'm going to eat something. Right Ooh, the ice cream and bake shop. Today's specials. Banana split, they have breads, cake pops, sugar cookies, brownies, cones, frozen coffee, and cakes. Let me see that cake. We're going to the winery. And there's a Christmas store, apparently. <laughs> there's a lot of Christmas stores here. Yeah. I dig it, though. We gotta check one out. Christmas, 365. The Apple Barn Winery. Wine made on site. I think they have a tasting. We're gonna go check it out. Woohoo! Welcome to the Apple Barn Winery. Go ahead and give us a thumbs up if you enjoy this trip. Or something. I love it. Thank you so much. <laughs> you know this? It's a rocking chair. I would love to bring some wine and a rocking chair in my patio. Bring some into Dollywood. Okay. <laughs> huh? What kind of fence do you normally you normally drink drives? Yeah. What do you like? What's your uh, preference? I like cab. Cab. Um, then I would Muscadine. recommend I try the Merlot. Ours okay. isn't quite as strong as most Merlots. It's a bit softer. Okay. Deal. Yep. This is the apple pomegranate. Cheers. Cheers. This is you, right? Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you. Mmm. Mm. Oh, sweet though. Oh my god, I'm so glad. Thank you for letting us try. <laughs> apple strawberry. This is like soda. Oh my god. <laughs> that's good. I, it makes sense. Oh, because that's, that's good. That's amazing. I'm excited. All right. Apparently, it has a. <laughs> Very unique flavor, muscadine. 
It kind of tastes like white grape. It tastes like white grape Ooh, juice. It definitely has a little law back there. <laughs> a what? A law. A law. A law. <laughs> Woodsy, Woodsy. Woodsy. <sighs> This is a Merlot. Yeah, it is a little dry. It's got a good grace flavor though for those pom That's not bad. That's not even like super dry like Cabernet. Mm. Yeah, no. I want a bottle of that. So I made a purchase. <laughs> Sporting local business. <laughs> yeah, we just did the wine tasting. It was awesome. Candles in Christmas shop. Unfortunately, the Christmas shop is closed now. We're here a little later and they closed at five. Next time. Yeah, I we're gonna go check out the restaurant. So cute. <laughs> I almost <laughs> You gotta leave that. Oh my god, I used the sidewalk raised. <laughs> Look at the rocking chairs. Here's your rocking chairs. You wanted to drink oh your wine? God. Did you bring a wine opener? This one is so fun. It's an iron. This is cute. Like These are the hours. Okay, we're at the Applewood Farmhouse Grill. They give you a complimentary single serving of apple fritters, apple butter, this julep juice. Look at these apple fritters and apple butter. So we're cheating today. Kim has lost 50 pounds. I'm close to 40, so we decided we deserve it. So. And there's no way we could come here and not indulge and not get this. <laughs> I'm excited about this juice. What did you yeah, say it's it was called? called? Julep juice. Julep it's juice. like pineapple and orange and lemon. <laughs> nice. It's like a mild orange juice kind of. It's not tart, not super sweet, refreshing. Yeah, it tastes a lemon too. Yeah, I love the little cup too. It's a little cute. cup. <laughs> this is the menu. Yeah, fried chicken, pot pie, chicken tenders, chicken and dumplings, meatloaf. Aaron's getting the Nashville hot chicken mac and cheese. I'm so getting that. I'm and these that we need to try I'm right, right now. now. Apple butter. Oh, get your napkin ready, Aaron. Seriously? Is it good? <laughs> My turn! Powdered sugar. I can't oh. wait to see what you think. It smells like fried business. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> and more powdered sugar. Sugar, what real sugar! Our next course is here is the baked potato soup. You can get baked potato or vegetable. It smells like cheese, man. Sure. <laughs> That's a savory comfort soup right here, man. Alright, sure. I'm gonna try it. Yeah, well that went down in about 2.5 seconds. Mm -hmm. What's taking you so long? I'm trying not to eat the chunks of potato. Uh, Just to save a little carbs. A little carbs. Mm -hmm. Oopsie. What'd you get, Erin? I got some Nashville hot chicken on top of some southern macaroni and cheese, some broccoli casserole, and some coleslaw. This is the first time I've had mac and cheese in almost half a year, and I love It's like 130 days or something. I'm so excited. Ooh, I'm already full, but <laughs> this is sweet potato casserole, mac and cheese, this is chicken and dumplings, uh, two pieces of fried chicken, and chicken pot pie. That's the trio, these three. So you get all of this, the soup, the apple butter, fritters, which are the amazing, fritters, and the juice for like 18 bucks. Yeah, it's a, it's really great price. Yeah, for real. Well, like, well I hope it. it tastes good. We did all we could do. Oh my god, I'm so full. I can't yeah. eat anymore. <laughs> this is what happens when you don't eat carbs. When you do, you can eat maybe for... This chicken pot pie was my favorite. Yes, she, she literally... I tell you the last time I had chicken pot pie. And it was like, um, she did the hot chicken with the mac and cheese. Once you like cut the chicken up and stir it all together, it was amazing. The coleslaw is great, sweet and fresh. And my broccoli casserole is great. We got our goodie bag. <laughs>
Wine and dinner for later. <laughs> I'd rather the coffee than the wine. Okay. <laughs> I'm ready for bed oh, after. I'm ready for bed after oh, those carbs. Little so fire pit. Okay, look. Come over here. Okay. Come over here. Oh look. I found a new subscriber. Yeah. He wanted to be in the vlog. <laughs> What's your name? Levi. Levi. My name's Kim. Nice to meet you. You're super cute. You are super cute. <laughs> you are so nice. This fire is so nice right outside the restaurant. Ooh, that's putting off some heat. Can we get one of these in the RV? <laughs> Is that safe? I'm not too sure. I would love it though. Right outside the restaurant here. The restaurant we just ate at was delicious. Those apple fritter things mm -hmm. with the apple butter. That's literally the reason to come here. Everything else is great, but like literally come here for that alone. For real. So right across from here, they have a beautiful creek on the other side of the road. So we're gonna go check it out without dying. Don't get dead, Aaron. I make no promises. <laughs> we're walking off our carbs, walking off our carbs. <laughs> I'm gonna try to get down without hurting myself. We didn't even know this was here. Nope. If you were brave enough or had the right shoes on, you could head over to that little pebble beach. Uh-huh. I'm well, not appropriate, but I kind of want to. Touch the water. Is it cold? It's not like brisk. It's like, it's not warm, but it's not like super cold. We're just taking a nice stroll. It's beautiful. Down on this end over here, there's an Applewood Farmhouse restaurant. They have a little gazebo, some outside seating. Those twinkle lights are beautiful. Looks really nice. Yeah. All right, we're gonna walk up here and see if they, maybe they have a menu outside. All right, so we looked over the menus and it looks very similar to the place we just ate at. They give you the same apple butter and the apple fritters and the juice all right we figured out the differences between these restaurants we're figuring like we looked at the menu they have it listed outside the graphics and everything are very similar we noticed the menu is similar but we're like what's what's the difference so i went inside to ask the hostess and this is the og restaurant this building has been here for over 100 years it was a home they turned into the restaurant the apple farm, orchard, whatever you want to call it. And because they were so popular, they ended up opening the rest of the plaza with the ice cream shop, the candy store, the moonshine distillery. And they were so popular, they opened another restaurant. The one we just ate at. Exactly. So the menus are very similar. They both have those apple fritter, mm -hmm. apple butter, little amazing little bites. But this restaurant has a more in-depth menu, a more, um, I wouldn't say secret, but things, specialized things you items. Things can't get at the other restaurant. Exactly, and specialized items, and there's actually a swinging porch swing table. Like, like quarter deck? Yeah, kind, no, they're literally hanging swing tables oh, wow. that are inside the middle of the restaurant. So, so you we can, picked the wrong place? Yeah, but they are open for breakfast, so I think we're gonna come back and check out breakfast I'm in down. a future video, so down. stay tuned. Can get some to go? Famous Applewood fritters, you can get them to go. Oh. oh, I have one in my to-go box. <laughs> they have all these little cute gazebos. The outside seating looks very nice. For real. I love those lights. I love them. They have the outside tables right there. With the view of the water right there. That's where we were at the top of the general store, way up there. <laughs> Looks like a big barn. Yep. If you look in the, behind this creamery building, those are apple orchards back up there. Something you don't see in Florida all the time is beautiful old Ford. 1951. Wow. 
Ugh, they need to make cars in this. Why don't they make cars that look like this anymore? Oh, no. They're bringing back the 90s hair. Why can't they bring <laughs> back the 50s cars? At least the style. I understand the inside it should be different, but the style for sure. Here's a better view of all the apple orchards. So we've had a great time today at the Apple Barn and Cider Mill. Mm -hmm. We didn't know much about this place, but it's beautiful. Once we pulled up, we were like, all right. Mm -hmm. And we've literally spent like four hours here. <laughs> so we didn't plan to make a day of it, mm -hmm. but that's what happened and I'm not mad about it. Not at all. It was really cool. It was actually really fun, really cute. And all the cider was delicious. The, the wine, wine tasting, tasting was up my alley and I really enjoyed it. Again, we've we got a bottle, our, our take home, the rest of our carb dinner mm -hmm. and our wine for dessert, so, mm -hmm. and our coffee. So, mm -hmm. we had a great time. Thanks again for coming along with us today. Mm -hmm. We really appreciate all everyone's support. And if you did enjoy this video, please give us a like, thumbs up, subscribe, and leave a comment. And again, thanks for being with us today. See you in the next episode. Bye. I'm enjoying my dessert from the Apple Barn Winery. My nice dry Merlot, it's really good. Um, I thought you were supposed to be making me coffee. Cheers. Where's the coffee? I want coffee. And a cute puppy.